Welcome back. Welcome back. Welcome back to the channel, y'all. Gemini Divination Oracle 333. Thank y'all for y'all likes, y'all shares, y'all subscribes, and everything that is going on. I thank you. <laughs> I appreciate it. I've been doing a lot, trying to find different ways, working on to see what apps are legitimate so I can do some type of content creation with that. Because I know some of y'all are probably looking in it, looking at it, and it's like you don't want to get into it and waste your time. So this is what I'm here for. Thank y'all for y'all support. Thank y'all for everything that y'all do. Let's dive in, dive in, deep in on this reading. So let me get everything cleansed, y'all. Get y'all cleansed. <laughs> and let's see what's going on. Let's see what needs to be said. I'm going to get into the true emotional deck. I've really been getting that there's a lot of emotions going on, going wild, miscommunication, or a person knows what they're doing and acting like it's a miscommunication. In this there's people in your life that may even be, you know, sh showing you an energy that they're not trying to help themselves, but they're saying it with words. I don't know if it all makes sense. Spirit, tell me what I need to see for the collective with Geminis. I'm getting somebody is phony. Somebody is a trickster. Y'all, somebody is living, somebody's trying to give some type of illusion, some fairy tale that ain't even real. Giving a fairy tale that ain't even real, y'all. A jackass. Somebody is dealing with the jackass, a phony trickster illusion giving jackass whatever they're doing they're trying to create a loser so that you won't you know um yeah we can all make sense not happy love child maybe this person got a love child or you have a love child or with this person or this person stepped out of the relationship and had a love child with someone and they're an asshole making it all make sense y'all that's <laughs> what the cards just saying what else spirit running so i'm getting that you're running away from a jackass you're running away from a jackass that's giving too many illusions this person is phony they're doing whatever it takes and acts like whatever they need to act like in order to get what they want what else spirit i'm getting you rejected this person that maybe wanted to try again in a relationship with you friends family lover making it all make sense i'm getting that you rejected someone who was phony in your life someone who would play with their words to fool you or cause illusions and say things that they really don't mean because they're not using actions what else spirit i'm getting a jezebel in center of the reading so this jackass is dealing with the jezebel they were lying to you about a relationship or they were lying to you about who they were with or who they were running with so you left that situation where it was at i'm getting you and them were bumping heads and that's another reason why you left the situation or you left them behind you probably rejected their offer i'm getting as well because this person has freaking secrets. This person has secrets but can't. Whoever this is has secrets and they just can't even come to you real. You either let this person hanging or this person left you hanging for a Jezebel. That's probably why they disappeared. Didn't say anything. And that was that. I'm getting that the truth and discovery is coming out that's going to awaken you to either leave this relationship if you have not left this relationship yet this person or you are feeling like ish due to the fire storms going on in your life and or the person that you were dealing with is feeling like shit because the secret accounts they got to get on to watch you because they can't be in your energy there is a mirroring effect going on. At first, you were always wanting to be around this person in this person's energy. And now it's like, it's the opposite. Like, you ain't trying to deal with it. And now they're trying to call you, trying to figure out what you got going on. And you and, and maybe you're trying to play fake busy when this person was trying to play fake busy. Like, when you really needed their attention or needed or wanted to be around them. 
they play fake busy and then once you saw what this fucking game was, you flipped the goddamn on script. You gave yourself self love up. All this drinking and toxic lifestyle, you left that where that was at. Hmm. You said goodbye to this person. This person ain't feeling that shit. You reject them. They not. It's like they trying to come at you so many ways to try to get back into your energy. And they realize that after so long, those little tricks and those plans that they trying to put around you, they not working. Like you not. That's like a turn off I'm getting. So y'all, let's see what's going on. Let's see what needs to be said. Clear. Clear, clairvoyant, clairaudient messages. What do I need to see? Spirit, what do I need to see? Clear, clairvoyant, clairaudient messages. I'm getting something about... It's hard for somebody to release a relationship. Maybe it's hard for somebody to release a relationship because of the history. Breaking point. But you get into a breaking point. It's like you are trying, you are wanting to release someone that is pulling too much energy from you. There's no reciprocity. And maybe you're thinking, hey, what happened if I do release them? Because I'm getting that you're getting to your limit. You're getting to a breaking point. And it's just getting, like, I'm getting, I'm getting someone saying so many damn sense. I'm getting beginnings. Try again. New direction. Start over. So, yes, like I said, this is hitting, releasing in reverse. So, whether somebody's releasing somebody or somebody is in their mind, they're going to release someone. It can even be family or someone you treat as if family. Someone is getting to a breaking point with whoever this is somebody wants a new beginning a new direction a start over try again like maybe someone wants to you know move forward with being by self because of the breaking points in this relationship i'm getting something about an intuition i'm getting something about whether it be parenthood someone being pregnant someone dealing with someone within the family there's some um some type of intuition, telepathy, inner knowing about something that's going to end or someone is going to erupt or there's going to be some type of daggone breaking point. I'm getting something about a beautiful woman that likes makeup or wears subtle natural makeup, charming, graceful, kind-hearted type energy. I'm really getting that this person is getting to a breaking point and this person has some intuition of whatever is coming someone wants a new beginning but they don't want a new beginning with people that bring them to a breaking point hmm? what else spirit i'm getting realization maybe a beautiful person realizes and came to a realization that there needs to be an ending for a new beginning ending relationships with pe people places and things that serve no purpose in your life who consume you who absorb you and not caring about what you have going on in your life. What else, spirit? I'm getting karma. Someone's getting karma, and I'm getting um someone. Someone has an intuition that someone's going to get karma, or you, Gemini's, you know that someone's going to get karma for hurting you, trying to break you, trying to destroy you. I'm getting over them lusting. I'm getting them not being loyal. I'm getting this person wanting to trap you in a situation to where you would not be able to get out of it so easy. Being exhausted and not having energy to do the things that you need, want, and desire because others are standing in the way. Like they're not giving reciprocity. Like when you pouring a cup, they looking at you crazy and you 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 is not even this the expecting the knowing that if I pour into your cup, you know, if I pour into your cup, you're supposed that you know it's a y'all, it's a rule to that shit. It's levels to it. So y'all, let's get into another message. I think this is the Rose Mystic Oracle deck. I'm finna see what's going on. I may try to go live today, y'all, but you know, trying to get these games together, see how much money I'm going to make. I know I 
already made probably like ten dollars on my paypal then i have frisbee i got plenty like over sixteen thousand points on there then i got fetched got plenty of points on there i got benjamin i mean like i'm trying to work these apps to see which ones are the best or which ones because this e pedometer app don't get that app and especially they talking about some seven days they're gonna paypal you I look, I went on them reviews and it strictly said they they not they not paying out. That's the whole scam. So that's my personal opinion to me playing and me walking and doing all that and it's a whole scam. I'm getting something about old school outdated thinking, conditioning, replaying events over in your head. So maybe maybe um this may be you. Or this may be someone that has old school, outdated thinking. What else, spirit? Sunglasses. So I'm getting somebody is watching, looking. Um, someone's stalking. Maybe someone who is old school or someone with outdated thinking and outdated thinking and conditioning. I don't know. Something about events playing in somebody's head. Ooh, I'm getting sores in roses. So I'm getting there's some I'm getting some type of clarity and truth about a situation. There's a revelation about who has been watching you or who has been doing weird stuff in the energy. You're being protected from whatever or whoever's watching you and trying to destroy what you got going on. Through your determination and perseverance, this person can't stop nothing in your life. If anything, they like falling like a big dog. What else, spirit? Clear, clairvoyant, clear audience messages. Tell me what I need to see for the collective. I am getting Teddy Bear, someone that is interested in you, but has old, old outdated thinking, wants a romance, wants to date you. But I'm getting this person has outdated thinking. Maybe you were around this person or this person has who has this old school mindset, even if they're younger and or older. But maybe this person want to date you, but I'm getting somebody messed it up before they can even get to first base, before they can even get a hug. What else? I'm getting karmic relationship in the center of the reading, y'all. Karmic relationship relationship someone that you probably were in a karmic relationship with friends family or lover is watching and looking stalking and trying to get a perception of who you are what you doing or are you doing good without them type of shit what else spirit clear clear point clear audience messages for the collective of gemini's i am getting that someone is trying to meet someone is trying to talk Maybe someone wants to give the truth about something that's been hidden. I'm getting something about maybe someone wants to um, build a friendship with you as well. I'm getting there's going to be some clarity and truth and rela revelation with the relationship that's probably coming in that's friendship wise. I'm getting that maybe... You have friends that's going through karmic relationships, or maybe there was a friend within the group of friends that wanted a relationship with you, but they messed it up with their energy. Mm. What else, spirit? I'm getting abundance, positive mindset, manifest gratitude, bliss, and blessings. So I'm getting someone sees you how abundant you are and how things come to you easily and effortlessly through how your paradigm works. And they want to be a part of it. And they saw you as abundance. They saw you as a, a per, you know, a person that's going to offer and give. And this is not that camera. And someone is reminiscing. Maybe someone's making memories and um, learning from past karmic relationships. And all this person can do is just watch you. That's the only thing that they can do. What else, spirit? I am getting maybe someone that want to come around and want to give you the truth and want to drink over coffee or tea or whatever the situation is. I am getting that this person wants to come in to distract you. 
I'm getting this person has third party situations going on. And this is what's the reason for this karmic relationship that they have or who is ever having this situation. Someone is too lustful, too jellabellish, too, you know, they're the type where they hook up and they date and they have third party situations and they tempt people in weird things happen. I'm getting maybe this is why there's a separation. As I said, I'm getting that you're you're messed up because you wasted your time, but you're not her heartbroken at all. And then I'm getting this person backstabbed you. So you can be you can be heartbroken to the fact that this person couldn't have been honest and tell you what was going on, and then they were lying and you know being deceptive. And you know I'm getting something about shocking attacks, or maybe this person is an abusive domestic v type of person but thank y'all for y'all like y'all shares and y'all subscribe if you're trying to hit me up for a message remember members only 5.99 um that's members only and members only your readings are on a discount they are 30 dollars. if you're not a members only those readings will be 50 dollars. if you're trying to get questions and answers extended that means you ask a question i give you the answer and the reason why and what else I can pull out of that reading or, you know, pulling on cards, uh, that's going to be $15.55. Until the next one, y'all, peace, love, prosperity, and protection.